everyone. My name is Jesse Houghton, and I'm a product manager on Visual Studio working on GitHub Copilot. This is one of my favorite features because it has totally changed how I talk to Copilot and communicate my thought process so I can get the best responses possible. It's called Copilot with Vision. It's the ability to attach images to my prompts. And images are really worth a 1,000 words. So I don't have to enumerate exactly what I'm talking about. I can just let the image do the talking. Let me show you exactly how this works. I've got this brand new Razor page that I've set up in this project. I'm actually going to ask it, can you help me build a page that looks like this? Now, this is super vague, but let me do an image upload. I'll go ahead and add a pizza website as my starting image and add that directly to my prompt. So now when I send this off, GPT-40 is using that model capability that it can look at the images and understand what's going on. I didn't have to describe all of this content in words. It looks at all of the images and all of the formatting on this page and gives me a really, really good starting point for what this pizza website might look like. So this is looking good to me. And let's see, where did it suggest? It suggests I add it to a new pizza page.razor file. So let me go ahead and create a new one in my components pages folder. I'll go to there and add a new item here. And then I can add that copilot suggestion directly into this file. So let's go ahead and copy it. And I'll paste it right in here and make sure that I've got all of the parts. So now I was able to apply that pizza page. And it wants to make sure that I'm referencing that properly from my home page. So I'll go ahead and preview that. And I can accept those changes. So I'll just paste that in there. Awesome. I want to make sure that I'm including any images that it's suggesting that I add. And I can always go back and add that later. Now that I've got this starting page all worked out, I'm going to actually open up my edits. And this is going to help me make some multi-file edits. I'm going to try and do something ambitious here and ask it to do a couple different things concerning images. Um, can you add some navigation elements consistent with this sitemap? And I'll go ahead and add an image of the sitemap I'm talking about. Again, if I were prompting this with just words, I'd need to describe all of the connections. I'd need to describe all of the different pages I want to include in the sitemap. But I'm going to let the image do the talking. And it's going to add some navigation elements to my home page. It's read my image for me and helps me create new pages for the About Us service product pages. So I don't have to do all of that heavy lifting on my own. I'll just let Copilot do the work for me. It's going to apply all of these navigational elements, and then I can tab to accept. So the power of edits is really boosted by adding images. Let's go ahead and keep it going. And I'm going to add a order form that looks like this. This is just a generic order form, but I'm hoping that it can be smart enough to kind of turn it into a pizza order form. And then. I want this order form to actually start working. So I'll say with this database to back it up. And I'll add a database image. So really, I'm trying to demonstrate that it can understand tons of different kinds of image content. And the possibilities are really endless with how you can leverage images when you're working with them in your prompts. So as it's creating that plan, um, I just want to share that this new icon allows you to add those images. You can also take screenshots and paste them directly into um, your Copilot prompt box so that you can get started asking Copilot questions with images. Um, these are available with GPT-40. And 
I'm actually also using a Copilot free subscription right now. So it doesn't matter what tier you're on, you can get started using images right away. So it looks like it iterated on that previous set of changes that I added, added some new suggestions with all of those data components so that I'm making sure I created that database properly. And all thanks to just a few words and lots of images, Copilot is definitely getting smarter, and I'm able to work with it even better now that I've got Copilot with Vision. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.